Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it is your host with the most white boy, 7 Street, bringing you some beautiful Battlefield 3 gameplay, and I end this game so epically, I break the universe. The ending to this game is absolutely amazing, and I just want to put that out there. So, I was asked by EA, what do I want to see in Battlefield for multiplayer? And first, I think that's absolutely amazing. I know a few of my other ideas have got into other first-person shooters, so they don't only want to see what I want to see. They want to hear what you guys want to see, so let them know in the comments down below. I think it's the perfect time in development where they got the foundation of the game probably built already, but they're looking for things to add. They're looking for maps. They're looking for cool, awesome ideas, and they can still tinker with a lot of stuff, so... I think having the most minds work on this problem or work to try to get something better is the best way to go about it. So please leave some feedback. I'm going to give you my opinions on, on what I want to see in Battlefield 4. I'm not the biggest Battlefield player in the world, but I have done my fair share of murder on the Battlefield. I have done my duty, you know, 1942, Bad Company 2, Battlefield 3, the Vietnam Expansion Pack. All the expansion packs of Battlefield 3. I did my fair share of Battlefielding. And I think it would be awesome. Because Battlefield is such a different beast in terms of first person shooters. I love the interaction with the environment that it can be destructed. And vehicles and vehicles destroying the environment. I think that's awesome. So the first thing that I would want to see is a map. This is a map suggestion. So... A city. I don't know if it would be something like Miami. Oh, look at this right here. I gotta point this out. So, I barely win that gunfight, right? I'm on 2% health. I'm on my last limbs. I'm laying down. This guy comes perfect. Like, not perfectly because I miss him, but I shoot him a good amount and he ends up having 1% health and he gets the kill somehow. 2%, 1%. I like 2% milk better than 1%. That's going to be a big controversy in the comments down below. My favorite milk is chocolate milk, but if I would have to go 2%, 1%, you know, fat-free, it's 2% all the way. You guys can leave those comments down below, too. I know that's going to be, like, a really touchy subject, and people are going to get their feelings hurt about, you know, milk drama and debates. So, <laughs> anyways, I think it would be really awesome to have a map like Tokyo, maybe, maybe... Miami, maybe even North Korea, where it's a downtown, like, really city area with big buildings. A lot of buildings are destroyed, kind of like, well, not like this map, a little bit more, a little bit more intact than, than this map, and the thing about it would be the city streets would be flooded. Some streets would be flooded, like the attacker side would be flooded, so you have like water routes into the city and into the objectives and stuff and then the defenders have like city streets going into water and i think you could implement jet skis maybe i just like the the, the dirt bike so much that you, you know it's so fun maybe i want jet skis but i think that that would be kind of cool and the thing about that would be that the water would be like maybe two feet deep where you could still you know drive your your ground vehicles as well as your water vehicles so just imagine you're going like 60 miles per hour in the hummer down the street and then there's the water the water starts to come the the flood water starts to come in and you just make this huge splash and it's just so cool you get all the other players wet and then they get like dirt in their eyes and <laughs> i no, i i just think it'd be cool because the battlefield for look at this drop shot wait for him he, wait for him Wait for him! No scope, and then his body falls on me. <laughs> It'll get him off me. So I think it'd be awesome because the Battlefield 4, that trailer that they released, it was so beautiful, the water. If you if you paid fine detail to the water, it looked amazing. And I think just I think they should implement that and use that to its full ability and have a flood map and just have like North Korea where everything I I believe in North Korea isn't built to the standard that it is in most of Oh no scope from above 
the game freezes. I don't know what happened, but that was awesome. I did that drop shot, no scope, don't deploy the parachute to my grenade launcher, and then it just kind of breaks the known universe. So I'm not, I'm not sure. Sorry for these technical difficulties. Like, it was literally frozen. I was like, what? Was that so cool that I just froze the game? So I got another gameplay here uh, coming up in about two seconds. We got a two for one special because I had a lot of ideas up here in my brain that I want to give. And uh, hopefully you guys can give some ideas as well. So another thing that I would want to see, I think that would be a cool, uh, cool map and something that I haven't seen before in the first person genre. And just to, like, I don't know, flooding, a city getting flooded, maybe even, you know, Katrina because it, it was a war zone down there it was a battlefield in Katrina and that would just be so crazy to to see that and I think jet skis are freaking awesome so another thing I would want to see tomahawks are always good throwing objects are always fun can we freaking like cook grenades in battlefield 4 I heard there's some kind of like trickery that you can do to cook grenades in battlefield 3 that you have to like hold the, the shoot button and then you cook then you throw the grenade but I wish cooking grenades w was a feature and that would be just a nice little thing I think everybody would appreciate and I just want more vehicles more players I think the PS4 and the Xbox 720 and Battlefield 4 having the, the new technology that it will have and they've been working on this game for you know two years now it doesn't come out every year like Call of Duty Battlefield comes out every two years, so they have time to work and like really fine tune this game and make it really good. So hopefully, uh, they're they're utilizing the next gen consoles technology, and they get to make the maps bigger, better, more vehicles, more helicopter battles. I I, I love that warfare. I love the the immersiveness that you can get if you if you're just flying the jet. You don't know really what's going on in the ground on the ground battle it's it's awesome it's awesome so i think more vehicles and what do you guys think about this i really like the the drone the quad rotor in black ops 2 would you guys want to see a vehicle like that a remote i know they have like little recon vehicles and i think some i i'm thinking back to battle uh bad company 2 I feel like one of them had a little machine gun, but it wasn't that powerful. I wouldn't want to, like, uh, a mounted, uh, not a mounted, a remote controlled vehicle that can shoot explosives. I think that'd be cool. What about, like, an AGR type of thing where it's an assault robot on the ground where it goes a little bit faster, you have a little bit more freedom to it, it's a little bit weaker, and the downside of it, you know, the. The plus for every uh, reaction, there's equal and opposite reaction. So, since it's a little bit faster, it, it'll be a little bit weaker, and as as well as you can't capture enemy stuff with it. Or maybe there's just a oh my god, how about this? How about robot battles with just bot wars? We did bot wars with uh, K-pop on the channel. It was like a one v one in Black Ops Two. You can search it on the channel if you want to see it. So basically, we had the Dragonfire and an ARG in our inventory, and we just battled it out. We just had a, a robot battle. And what if they had, like, Battlefield, what they're doing in this game, it's kind of like team gun game. So what about team robot battles where it's a whole bunch of just, I think that would be awesome. Robot battles! That would be so freaking cool. I think that would be amazing to, to have. So... Just a friendly writing reminder, if you're still watching to this point, appreciating the Battlefield 3 on the channel, give it a like rating, give it some love, uh, that's always, you know, it always helps and I appreciate that, so keep it up guys, you guys make me keep making these videos with your support, as long as I got you guys, I'm not going anywhere, so I just want to give a shout out to the GOAT Army for, for the amazing like ratings on my channel over the last uh, week or so. It's been amazing, so thank you for that. I just I just advanced a lot of weapons right there. That was that was very nice. I was hiding, I was scared, and <laughs> I got a few kills. So that was, that was pretty convenient. So yeah, I, I think Battlefield 4 is gonna be awesome and it's gotta be nice to see what the next gen 
systems are going to bring to the table. And this guy really, really, I missed all my bullets to your little pistol. You just danced around my spaz like that, bull, bull. I don't want that in Battlefield 4, all right? If I have my spaz, and that guy should have just died from being scared. All right, there's this spaz going off around him, and he's he's still living. I don't get that. So, C4s. Oh, I need to say this about the C4s in Battlefield. Please have a little, let them be thrown a little bit. Let them have a, a, a little bit of <laughs> throwiness to it, because... You throw a C4 and you, you, you're like jump, you'd be running off a cliff, you look up, you throw it, and it literally goes like two feet and I, I try to explode, like I'll try to explode something and it just doesn't work. I end up exploding myself, like I can't throw it at any, like if I want to detonate it instantly, I'm, I'm messed up. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. So I wish the C4s, you could toss it a little bit, that's all we're asking for, just a little bit of tossage on the C4. So I think that's uh, that's pretty much it for me, guys. As I said, we're looking for ideas. They could be in the game. They could be in the game, so that'd be really cool. Let us know. Comment down below. Battlefield 4, I'm looking forward to it. And are you ready for war? Are you ready for gore? And explosions galore? I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye.